फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वी विल एक्टिवेट पेरोल फीचर फ्रॉम अकाउंटिंग फीचर पेरोल यस कंट्रोल टू एक्सेप्ट चेंजेस विल कम बैक टू पेरोल एम्प्लॉय फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वी विल क्रिएट एम्प्लॉय ग्रुप लाइक एडमिन सेकेंड वी विल क्रिएट एम्प्लॉय लाइक आमिर एंड विल कीप इन अंडर एडमिन डिपार्टमेंट हिज डेट ऑफ ज्वाइनिंग इज वन वन एम्प्लॉय नंबर now we will make unit for work hours it means hours now we will make attendance and production type present present is the attendance live with pay absent absent is the live without pay and will measure in days then is overtime overtime is also production type okay and will measure in hours now we'll make pay heads first is basic salary basic salary is an expense uh, basically is an uh, earning for employee will keep under the uh, under indirect expenses for company and as is the defined value second is da it's on uh, it's also earning for employee i'm providing in percentage for every employee da will be 40% whether it do it doesn't matter what is the basic salary of him but he will get 40% of his basic salary as da now hra I'm giving 20% of sum of basic salary as well as DA, and its 20% will be considered as HRA for an employee. Now I'm making a criteria: if total of basic salary DA as well as HRA. Around nine thousand rupees, then he will get in value thousand rupees. If it's between nine to twelve thousand, he will get fifteen hundred rupees as TA traveling allowance. And if it is more than twelve thousand in value, he will get two thousand rupees as TA. provident is deduction from employee indirect income for company as computed value from sum of basic dhra ta we will deduct for any value in percent 2.5 for all employee 2.5 is the percentage for pf that we are deducting from the total salary of an employee over time on production sorry on production 
over time here is one mistake that i did we'll come back to pay head basic salary alter basic salary is not user defined now in case of pre uh, present and attendance if we, we will keep it on attendance present monthly as user defined month will be uh, month is of 30 days it decided by company the working days of a month so in my company it's 30 days means here will be a month of 30 days now we'll make salary detail we'll come back to salary detail create Amir. basic salary suppose his basic salary is 5000 rupees DA will calculate it automatically HRA also TA also PF will deduct it automatically over time is 150 rupees per hour now we'll come to payroll voucher and fill attendance for Amir suppose Amir was present for 25 days in a month Amir was absent for 5 days in a month Amir over time is 10 hours this is the salary detail for Amir we'll click on this payroll button back and we'll come to payroll autofill we'll assign salary to Amir in cash all things has been calculated automatically we have filled the basic salary but this salary is deducted 5 days because 5 days he was absent this is the pay slip of Amir this is the printout of Paisley he was absent for 5 days he was present for 25 days his overtime is 10 hours his basic salary become 4166 because his basic salary was 5000 rupees but 5 days value has been deducted from this salary 5 days uh, salary has been deducted this is the DA, HRA and other things this is the deduction from his salary and total amount net amount he got is 9000 something is the pay slip for Amir. Like this we can calculate salary on the basis of 